On the table adventure we will have with LEGO Minecraft The Jungle Temple, set number 21132, 598 pieces, Steve, Ocelot, and two skeletons. On the back of the box, what treasures await? Change to new models. Watch out for that spear! Fascinating. Inside the box, instruction booklet number one. Instruction booklet number two. Two gray square base plates. One grass rectangle. Bag of bricks number one. Bag of pieces number two. Bag number three has some Lego in it. And I think bag number four is all right. And no stickers. You're awesome, Lego Minecraft. What say we build bag one and have some fun? For an arm! Ah Jerk. What I'm saying, Larry, is that we keep our extra bones in these chests over here. No one would ever suspect skeleton bones in the jungle in this chest. That is all. All right then. was a pretty good adventure we just had, wasn't it, Larry? Yes, it was. Hey, I'm just gonna go pick up my bone. Uh, wh what the? Hey, where did the chest go? Oh, man. Oh, that was one of my favorite bones. Oh, this is ridiculous. I'm gonna have to call my lawyer. Oh, unbelievable. Unbelievable.
Welcome to the Jungle Temple. How's it going, Steve, down at the Jungle Temple? Not right now. There's skeletons out here, you know? There are? Where? Where? Ah! Well, that's one less skeleton, Steve. So the Jungle Temple is a pretty impressive construction set, one of my favorites for the Spring 2017 sets. For some reason, I thought it would be a real quick and easy build, but it turned out to be just as long as all the others. It must be all the little moss stone blocks all over the place. Those always take a little extra time with these blocks. And they're all over the place, as well as these cool little moss question marks. It's the Temple of the Mossy Question Marks! I also like the overall grayness of this set. It feels very stable and somewhat soothing. Also very solid, this temple is quite the brick. And it looks like there's plenty of places to decorate it up with other LEGO Minecraft minifigures. This set, of course, has the Ocelot, Steve, and a couple skeletons. Almost could have used something else. As for fascinating features, let's remove this top. And inside we have a whole nother little world. Inside the temple, you will find Steve walking into some interesting features. Hold it right there, kid. You almost set off a spear. You have to be careful where you stand in one of these sacred places. Whoa, that spear just shot out of nowhere. Thanks, Indiana Jones. Steve, you're sure lucky to have friends. What other features does the Jungle Temple hold? Ooh, on this side, we've got levers. They don't do nothing. That's because you're not an archaeologist. Get out of the way. You have to move the levers in an appropriate pattern, probably modeled after the ancient Aztec god Hukataku, who protected his treasures with flat brick and technic pieces. I believe the wall is released. Well, let's let's find out about that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, the treasure chest with treasure. Excuse me. It's about darn time I found this. Well, that's a pretty cool trick. I would never suspect a chest in there. Good featuring temple. Anyhow, let's check out another model design of this jungle temple. We'll start by removing some of these temporary blocks. How's about that for a really impressive layout? Just using the roof pillars, we have now raised the whole temple up a floor, made it much more roomy, and can finally air out that mossy smell. Not to mention that litter box smell, eh, Maybelline? Ouch! That had to hurt. I think this layout would probably be your best displayable layout, but I also really like the original Jungle Temple. Let's try out one more idea. Okay, more of an open layout design floor with the open roof building and a extra little platform over onto the side. I like the front entrance going on over here, that's kind of neat, with the front pillars and torches. That's one thing this set could have really used, was about six more torches to liven the place up a bit. Only two is pretty dimly lit, but who knows what goes on in this temple. That's one angry ocelot. Let's get it back to the original design. There we go, back to Square Temple 1, and I think my favorite design. This would be a great displayable piece pretty much anywhere, and of course a great adventure playset as well. I'm almost thinking I like it just a little bit better than the waterfall base. Well done Jungle Temple, well done indeed. But I'm not gonna store any of my bones here, I can tell you what. Huh. 
Lego Minecraft The Jungle Temple appears on store shelves March 1st, 2017 and runs around 50. If you're fascinated by archaeological ancient temples that transform into pretty cool looking temples, this is the place for you. However, if you have slight moss allergies, perhaps you should bring your Claritin. Find this set before the ocelot can run away. That's what I have to say about that. A Minecraft squirrel would honor that temple. Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede. Please like, share, subscribe. Oh man! Curse this temple! Ugh. Get back here, Ocelot!